Hi everyone, I'm John DeFreitas, local real estate agent with Sutton Summer Realty, bringing to you another great neighborhood that you need to know, which is Palmerston, Little Italy in Toronto. So firstly, I'm not just gonna tell you about all the amazing things about this neighborhood, but I'm also gonna tell you about the things that you probably definitely wanna know before making a decision to move in here. Stick around to the end of the video because I think you're gonna find it interesting, okay? First off, Palmerston, Little Italy is located in central Toronto towards the west end of downtown. It borders Bathurst Street to the east and Dover Court to the west, College Street to the south and Bloor Street to the north. Within the pocket of Palmerston Little Italy are two main commercial strips. You've got College Street to the south which is where Little Italy is located and then you've got uh, Bloor Street to the north which borders Koreatown. Within that pocket toward the north you've also got Mervis Village which is a massive development that's being built on Bathurst and um, Bloor and that's the old location of Honest Ed's. Within this development, there's gonna be approximately 900 rental units being built, over 200,000 square feet of retail space, as well as about 25,000 square feet of open market. So it's an already dynamic area within the city, and it's just gonna be that much more interesting. All right, let's talk about some real key areas, that, the things that people love about uh, Palmerston Little Italy. Number one, the neighborhood streets. They've got some amazing neighborhood streets within this area, okay? I'm coming up to Montrose right now, which is a beautiful neighborhood street. Grace is just up on the left over here. Uh, and you've got some amazing streets. Markham, a beautiful street. And of course, Palmerston Boulevard, one of the most beautiful residential streets anywhere in the city. Definitely some, some place that you'd wanna hit and take a walk during a beautiful weather day. Other reasons people love living in Little Italy, Palmerston Village, is the amenities and the restaurants, cafes, and shops, some of the greatest anywhere in the city. You want one of the best espressos and cappuccinos around, you have to hit Cafe Diplomatico, all right? Do that while you watch a soccer game as well, well known for soccer events and its amazing patio. If you want one of the best Italian uh, ice creams around go to Sicilian ice cream cafe that's fantastic gelatos okay and finally one of the best pizzerias anywhere in the city is located in Palmerston Little Italy it's Betondo's Pizzeria the best pizza and definitely absolutely the best Ponzerotti anywhere in the city I'll put it up against any Ponzo anywhere in the country you must hit Betondo's Pizzeria for a Ponzo when you're in Little Italy all right other reasons people love it it's got tons of flavor and vibe, very multicultural, okay? It's the home of Chin and Chin Radio, uh, which was obviously, many of you may be aware of Johnny Lombardi, who was the founder of bringing the multicultural movement to the area, so that's another fantastic reason. All right, before we talk about the reasons that you might not wanna move into Little Italy Palmerston, let me fill you in on the real estate aspect, okay? Real estate in the area is pricey because it's such a high demand location, all right? So you've got detached homes in the area that are gonna run approximately 2.1 to 2.3 million dollars. For a semi-detached, they're gonna run you about 1.7, 1.8, and condominiums are gonna run you right around $725,000. Homes in the area, like I said, are in high demand, so they are selling over asking on average. So anything that's in the low million dollar range is gonna be uh, selling uh, for about 15% more than asking price. And they're not gonna last on the market long, uh, averaging between six and nine days on market for uh, detached and semi-detached properties. Now, let's, uh, let's get to the uh, interesting facts of why you might not wanna move into Palmerston, Little Italy. All right, the number one reason you might not wanna move into the area is it's extremely busy. I'm trying to find a parking spot as we speak and I can't find any spots around anywhere, okay? There's a lot of density in the area, okay? And if you own a vehicle, it's gonna be very difficult to find parking and it's also gonna be very difficult if you own a vehicle as your primary source of getting around. So just, you need to be careful about that, all right? And finally, probably the most significant reason why you may not wanna move into the area it's extremely noisy, okay? With all the restaurants and shops, it does make for a very loud area of the city. If you live within earshot distance of College Street and uh, it's about midnight on a Friday night, it's gonna be loud. So if noise is not your thing, you might not wanna move into the city uh, pocket as well. 
Okay. Besides all those factors, it is a really great place to consider moving into. I've looked at pockets in this area before when I've been looking for homes. Uh, it certainly has a lot of great things going for it on top of some of those things that you might want to watch, watch out for. Hey, I hope you really enjoyed this video. Hope you found it useful. I love bringing you neighborhood videos like this. One of my goals as a realtor is helping you live somewhere you love. And if part of that is making sure you're educated about different neighborhoods around the city, well, then I think I'm doing part of my job. So hope to bring you another great neighborhood real soon. Take care, everybody. Bye.